Well, parents and students in the southern part of Charlotte Mecklenburg School District are worried about potential changes to their school boundaries. It's something CMS has been working on for months, and tonight those families will get another chance to weigh in on yet more changes. Our education reporter Mary Calkins has been following every step of the process. This impacts a lot of families, Mary. Alex, that is absolutely right. It really does. But first, I want to make sure that all families are aware of a really important change. So tonight's engagement session was originally happening over at Artery Cal High School. Well, it's since been moved to here. This is South Mech High School, and it's happening at 6.30 p.m. So 6.30 South Mech High School, that's when and where CMS will release its latest plan for these new high school boundaries. So a new high school is being built um, on North Community House Road. When it opens in the fall of 2024, it will relieve overcrowding at South Mech and Artery Kell. The district says it's also making progress on securing land for a new middle school in the Ray Farms area. The earliest it would open would be in the fall of 2025 and will relieve overcrowding at Community House, J.M. Robinson, and Ray Farms. It will also impact some of the elementary feeder schools. So keeping those feeder patterns together. Those are the elementary and middle schools that feed into a high school. That is one of four top priorities the board has for redrawing boundaries. So the other three main priorities, that's minimizing the distance between home and school, creating, creating socioeconomic diverse schools, and making the most of the buildings and facilities. Now, because of all of this new work, a decision on the boundaries was moved from originally happening in February to now happening in June. And if you want to come out and make your voice heard, again, happening uh, get engagement session happening here at South Mech High School at 630 and we are going to let you know what happens in that meeting. For now reporting live in South Charlotte, Mary Calkins, WBTV on your side.